Hey, hey, collective, what's going on? It's Natalie here back with another channel message for you guys. Hope everyone is doing well today on this lovely Monday. All right, so we're going to tap and see what Spirit needs us to know right now. Thank you guys for all your likes, subscribes, your shares, all that good stuff. Emails, voicemails, um, donations, none of it goes unnoticed. All right, if you guys need a little more personal, you're more than welcome to email me. All right, my email is in the description box below for you down there along with everything else you need to know for this reading all right so let's see i'm getting like a amusing energy we have this new moon in cancer and it's like it's supposed to make you guys feel sad or emotional but it's actually making everything like funny like everything is funny to you or you're excited about things around this time yeah so we have phrases motivation you guys are getting affirmations or you guys could be um doing your own affirmations around this time yeah never give up be motivated okay meditations and stuff like that okay um giving yourself pep talks okay but yeah spirit wants you to know never give up on something okay Yes, yeah, so we have labyrinth journey. Never get, give up on your journey. It may seem like it's topsy-turvy, not going anywhere, like it's going in circles, but it's your journey. Okay, what else? We have harmony, peace. That's good energy. Um, power lines, energy. So if, when you act this way, other people act this way. But protect your peace, okay? Because people connected to you might not be so peaceful. Yeah, clouds, distractions. People actually may want to have your heads in the clouds or something like that. We have mirror, reflection, and flamigo, fun. I feel like you guys are having fun right now, or you guys are just in a fun attitude, okay? Whenever you're in this energy, it forces someone to look at themselves, okay? I feel like you're at peace with... <laughs> I don't know why I'm getting someone with like multiple personalities, but you're at peace with your multiple personalities, I guess, or whatever you got, ha whatever you got over here. Clarify phrases, motivation. I feel like you guys are always uplifting yourself. Phrases, motivation. Yes, we got divine flow. Eventually one sublime desire takes precedence over all others to follow the towel. The divine flow at all costs. So you're just going with the flow of things. You're not really uh, responding the way people want you to respond. Yeah, we have empathy here. I'm open to seeing both sides of the situation. I feel like people are trying to tug at your guys' empathy, though. I feel like they're trying to make you emotional, but that's not what's going on. I feel like you guys are actually lightening up your energy or being more positive. I'm hearing like laughing for no reason, like you guys are laughing for no reason or something. Clarify labyrinth journey. You understand this is just a, your journey and how it's supposed to go. We have individuality. Every person has their own personalized study plan in this earth school. I feel like you guys are following your own journey here. Limitless, see yourself open to receive in the most miraculous ways. The divine can use anything and anyone. Hmm. Limitless individuality. So you have no limits. Ah, that's what it is. You don't have any limits when you're by yourself. When you're around other people, your limits start to block. Like you're, I don't know, this is talking about work or family or something like that. Clarify peace and harmony. I feel like you don't want anybody interrupting your peace right now. Surrender. I can release my need to control. Yeah, so it's like you're also letting things just go. Like you're letting things flow just to have some peace in your life, okay? This could be you or someone else. I'm also getting like you don't have to work so hard for something, but yeah, divine abundance is here. You are born to align with love's will. Follow the talent, serve something beyond the ego. Learn to be abundant and not chase it. I feel like you guys aren't... You guys are peaceful. You're not chasing abundance right now. You're just taking things as it goes or you're being called to do this. 
I'm hearing the sky's the limit. But you don't have to chase it. That's also what I'm getting too. Like, the sky's the limit, but you don't have to chase it. I know that sounds kind of contradicting, but yeah. As long as you stay to yourself, you're protecting your energy, okay? Uh, power lines, energy. Divine source. A lot of divine energy out here. Help me know that all my deepest needs will be met. Let me trust that you have a plan and the right actions will come. You are my source for all. Just protect your energy. I feel like um, it's going to bring abundance for you. Something here is going to bring abundance for you. Honesty. I can't always expect the truth from others, but I can expect it for myself. Yeah. You don't want to be around other people because, I mean, it's not really in, in a negative way. It's giving me like you're the only person that could be honest with yourself. Okay. What is this talking about? Is this talking about work? I feel like you don't want any distractions. You don't want to be distracted. Okay, clarify clouds, distractions. We have ease. It's easy for me to receive. I feel like you guys don't want to be distracted right now. Ease. Liberation. Yeah, you're free. The doubts and fears still come up. You don't believe anymore that they're you. And allowing is here. You're just letting things go. Like you're letting things flow. Okay, something about you know that God will provide regret i know that i cannot change the past grief i understand that losing something is an opportunity to appreciate appreciate it okay ease liberation and allowing i'm hearing live and let live it's like you do you i do me type of energy we have awakening here Wake me up from life as a spiritual sheep. May I hear you through my own instincts and common sense. Hearing the voice of God instead of the voice of you or other people around you will benefit you greatly right now. Yeah, hearing his voice. Something here about love too. Uh, divine source is the idea that no person, place, or thing is your salvation, only love itself. Something about loving yourself. Uh, something about your own reflection here. Energetic clearing. Worth. Yeah. You have been worthy to belong to love all along without any need to improve. In fact, you are love itself. One herself may be emptying you of fear and attachments, preparing you to see her luminous plan. Something is coming in for you guys. Um, you may fear that it's not. It's going to come in freely for you guys. You don't have to worry about it. There's something here about like um, wondering if you're worthy for it. But no, you need to clear your energy out. Because there could be people or things in your energy that don't belong and they could be blocking you. In another sense... There's someone here playing with mirror magic, trying to mirror you. Someone is trying to mirror you so they could be in your energy, but it's giving me like um, a distraction. I don't feel like uh, people in this sense are necessarily karmic i just feel like they're distractions i don't feel like it's giving me karmic though i don't feel like the energy is karmic it's just distractions it's blockages it's you know people uh what's the word I'm trying to like piggyback we'll see what this is talking about I just don't, I don't feel like it's in a negative sense though. Okay, so we have devil's advocate, a leak out here, cyber bully and stalking, third eye chakra, you see somebody, you know exactly what they're up to, past life soulmate, you've met this person before, telepathy, I'm 
keep praying is here. All right. Star famous. So you guys are a famous star. Someone's coming right back around. Yeah, this is a setup. Someone here is trying to set you guys up for something. Yeah, because you're excelling spiritually. I feel like you're moving a little bit too fast for this person. Yeah, this is a setup. Adulthood, parenthood. What else? Road less traveled. Yeah, something about doing things on your own. Uh, doing things that not a lot of people know how to do, okay? So you can't have people around you stirring the pot. People want to stir the pot, though, because you're excelling spiritually. This people, These people are in mental prison because your chakras are aligned. It could be uh, educational or learning something. It could be a karmic sister involved. People are, like, cyberbullying you guys. But you constantly keep uh, putting your energy up. You're not letting anyone uh, send any negative energy to you. You know exactly what someone wants. This could be a parent too. And you're not dealing with this person here. So I feel like you're moving a little bit faster than somebody. They're trying to get the inside scoop on you. Maybe through the internet or something because you're a star or because they don't want you to be a star what's going on in here yeah seven of swords in reverse they've been caught i don't think this person's too smart i'm also getting something like spirit yeah caught this person yeah we have okay spirit caught this person or you caught this person or you're just too confident okay your confidence alone catches this person yeah, four pentacles in reverse. You release someone or something. I'm getting something about a group. Yeah, page of swords in reverse. Someone is trying to look up information on you. They're trying to stalk you or something on the internet or look up information, trying to see what you're doing because they see that you release them. Someone's like trying to get into your energetic field and they're going to get caught. That's what I'm getting for this energy. They'll get caught. Yeah, Queen of Swords, she caught somebody recently. You have may have caught somebody recently if you're a feminine. Being in your energy. You're just too smart for somebody or you see someone. You see someone very clearly. Page of Pentacles here. the moon yeah there's something here about your intuition or like your gifts are enhancing or something someone like you make someone something about self-esteem issues someone here has self-esteem issues or something because you're confident what is this talking about we have the nine of wands in reverse they have to drop their guards they have to stop doing something because like so i'm i'm picking i'm getting someone like um left a trail though that's why I'm getting someone got set up. They left the trail playing around in your energy. Yeah, Knight of Pentacles reverse. It didn't go anywhere. Also, someone can't find info on you. The heck? Someone's trying to find info on you because you're doing something different or you don't want to work with them or something. Three of Pentacles here as the outcome. Or this could be multiple people out here trying to get info on you. Seven of Swords in the reverse. They've been caught. What do they do? Ten of Wands. And the Chariot in the reverse. Something is too hard to do or too hard to deceive you or something like that. Something about your beliefs, okay? These people were not protected or this person was not protected. It's like, with the Ten of Wands out here, Seven of Swords in the reverse, it's like they're very... I don't know, burdensome. They didn't think that they were going to get caught. They fell on their own trap. Clarify the Queen of Wands. Queen of Wands. Who's the Queen of Wands? 
I feel it's your beauty. Your beauty is the trap, okay? Temperance. Someone got tempted to do something to you or to find information on you. That First of all, they can't find the information. And two, you're not what you seem to be. Five of Wands reverse, Ace of Wands reverse. You don't compete. You also don't compete with Empresses or Empresses in the reverse. You don't compete with anybody. Ten of Cups reverse. So someone here definitely misjudged you. Yeah, Ten of Pentacles. There's something that you also have here. These people don't have. You may have like um, money. You have your ancestors backing you up though. This give me like Earth Angel energy. Okay. Um. You have a legacy to worry about here. Commitment. Yeah, you got plans out here. Someone misjudged you, okay? Because you're you're directing your attention somewhere else here. Someone may be having car troubles or they cannot move forward or they're receiving obstacles or they got caught being messy in your energy. Uh, Six of Pentacles in the reverse. Yeah, they're not getting what they thought they were going to get. This Empress in reverse here too. Yeah. You're turning away from people that like want to take from you. Like they want to take from you or something and not give to you or they don't want anything balanced, okay? But you're not doing it in like a karmic way. You're just directing your attention somewhere else. You don't care for this energy. Something is going on in the internet. Someone may be trying to get like, they want you to leak information. They want you to say something, but it's not working. I'm getting a lot of spying here. Someone wants to betray you in a weird way, maybe with money. They want an imbalance to happen and then they like, okay. Someone is afraid to show their face too. Clarify the Queen of Swords. This is weird. I feel like you've been there, done that. Okay, you're not going to respond or you're not going to be too, you know, yeah, the hangman here. I feel like this person doesn't know what to do. They're just hanging there. You see this person. Ace of Wands reverse. Something here failed. Yeah, something about like it doesn't it doesn't grab your attention. It has to grab your attention. Or it has to... I don't know. It has to grab your attention for one. And it's not grabbing your guys' attention. So something here failed. They got caught and they actually trapped themselves. Page of Pentacles here. Yeah, six of wands. Something about your attention. I feel like you're gaining success here. There's something that you learned. We've got the king of wands out here. So we got the counterpart with the queen of wands. Something about the king of wands. You're very determined or ambitious. Yeah, the knight of wands here. I feel like someone is attracted to you, but I feel like they also misjudged you or something too. Yeah, Queen of Wands or Queen of Pentacles out here with the Tower, Eight of Swords in the reverse, Three of Swords in the reverse. You're not getting caught up in no contracts. That's what I'm getting for this energy. You don't care who it is. There's a mask on out here, though. They see your determination, they see your passion, they want to be involved. Clarify the moon. Yeah. Hierophant, it's a hidden contract. They want you, it, it's, you don't see this, but they want you in a hidden contract. Strength in reverse. They want you in something that's not going to last or something that's not going to be like a, um, a real bond. It's not going to work. They want you stuck in a weak contract. Yeah, two of cups in the reverse. It's like it's you're not relating to it. It's not good for you or you don't want it. They can't hold on to you. They can't hold on to you because number one, you don't relate with this person. There's something about this person you don't relate with or they're like not on your level or something. So you're not going to work with them or something. Yeah, the lovers in reverse, high priestess in reverse. You know, this person's karmic or like they're not following their intuition about anything so 
So this person definitely set themselves up in your energy. Um, but they want to keep stirring the pot. I feel like they want to keep stalking you or something. Nine of Wands in the reverse. So someone got to give up something out here. Yeah, the Ace of Cups is here. Something about self-love. Four of Swords. Healing. You may have like an overflow of abundance out here too. Yeah, and you got two karmic masculines out here. Two karmic masculine. One that's greedy, they're money hungry. The other one likes to play with your head. Or this could be one masculine, air and earth mixture. Uh, they cannot block you or something. Knight of Pentacles in the reverse. These people see you as a star going down a whole different road than them. And they're not even spiritual or something. Five of Pentacles in the reverse, yeah. So something about your money is improving, but these people are being slowed down trying to block you when it comes to money or something like that. Some of the things that like playing around with your money or something, it's going to block you or inhibit you. We have the Empress in reverse out here and the Six of Cups out here. Lovers in the reverse. Okay, someone is stuck to a karmic too. This is someone that, I don't know, they want to make you, they want to make you compete with a, um, an empress in the reverse. Who's this empress in the reverse? This person may have children. They want you to compete with someone that they have children with. You're not doing that. You don't really care. Okay. Clarify the empress in the reverse. <sighs> Wheel of fortune here. So it's like your, your life is still moving forward. You are the way. These people cannot move forward. I feel like they have maybe karmic. These are karmic masculines that have karmic feminines that they're attached to. That they will not let go of. Okay. So that's not your problem. You're going to keep moving forward. All right. That has nothing to do with you. But these people are going to cyber stalk you on the internet until you care about what they're going through. Wheel of Fortune and the Six of Cups. Clarify the three of pentacles as the outcome. Yeah, we have the eight of cups in reverse. They can't move on from whatever they're doing out here. Queen of pentacles. They also want you to walk away from your work. You're not doing that. Yeah, the magician. I feel like these are people that are jealous of your gifts. What else? These are people that are jealous of your gifts. Tower. Something about your power. Yeah, they thought that they per they did something and they trapped themselves, guys. I don't know what the heck this reading is about. They did something and they ended up trapping themselves. With the tower and the magician. They, they should have known that you had this type of power to like tear things down just by being mature. I don't know what the heck this is about. But I don't like it. It's giving me like stalker. People are stalking you. Um, trying to get your attention. But they end, they try to set you up for something. And it's not working. And you see this person. You know exactly what this person is up to. Yeah, stifled, bored, and stuck. These people are like truly just stuck. Um, something about energy vampire. Yeah, the signs are with you already. You see this person. You know this person is just bored. They just want to play. They're not like serious people. Okay. Powerful personal growth. You've done a lot of growth in your life. So like you see this before it even came. You have a clear solution to problems. They don't like this about you. I'm getting someone that's like very uh, business oriented. They don't like this energy of you being business oriented. They want you like... Um, um very i don't know i guess needy or yeah we got back off here you see clearly clairvoyant it's a clear solution yeah you know exactly what these people are up to and you don't have time for this energy you're just gonna get caught doing this yeah haunted faces ghosts and the haunted girl ghost people they try to haunt you but yeah 
Miracle is here. Ancient Wisdom. These are people that are still stuck to karmic. So even if you did work with them, they would they would involve other people in your mix that don't belong. You have the sixth house, health and organization. You're an organized person. They don't like this about you. When you're organized and you know where you know what to, how to handle something, this could be something about your business too. Success is what you make it. You're very successful at what you're doing. And it's like these people are mad about this or they feel like they can stalk you because you're successful. And get information on you. We have Yoni Steam, Womb Cleansing. You guys could be cleaning, cleansing your womb. What else? The story of Jonah. Uh, they're really talking about themselves, just saying your name. So these people are doing a lot of projecting right now. The story of Jonah may be talking about like how you're trying to tell a group of people something and they're not listening. Um, they're not getting the point of what you're trying to say. It's like they, they just still want to be in your energy and, and, you know, drain you. Dark worker, angel for the devil. The past is coming back. Hidden secrets. Someone's past is coming back up to haunt them. Predictive programs and movies, commercials, video games. Nowhere to run and hide. This person watches too many movies. They're unlucky and draining. Yeah, making their bed and lying in it. Yeah, and then we got the streets are talking. What else? So they got caught playing in your energy recently. I don't know who this is. Tell me more about this energy. They definitely work for the dark side. They don't work for the light side because if they did, they wouldn't be playing all these weird games. Yeah, we got friends and family influence. So you returned it back on them and their family. Return to sender. They should have been careful with that. Uh, Hinduism, something about Indians, um, gifts and abundances here. I feel like you're getting blessed by Ganesha. Yeah, so we got spiritual warrior here. Uh, the little mermaid, pray over your blessings. You've mastered this level. Hansel and Gretel, someone here plays too much. Like, they, they play way too much. The story of Joseph, uh, glamour, beauty, spills, mirror, magic, body, deformity. Someone doesn't want you to, like, tap into your gifts. Okay, someone just wants, like, you to be playing in the eighth house so that you can get your energy harvested from. But that's not going to work. You get blessings from the community or something. Jealousy, envy, gossip, and slander. These people are just mad that you're not like everybody else. And they're monitoring you. They're watching you. They're doing a lot of spying right now. Yeah, success is what you make it. All right, so this is your reading, guys. Hope this resonated for you. If it did, go ahead and like, subscribe, share to my channel so you don't miss any of my videos. I'll see you next time. Thank you. Bye.